another day kayaking it is beautiful today the winds died down so we're gonna do a little uh, extensive kayak ride today not 20 miles and then gator infested water or anything like that <laughs> but I actually want to go dive this sunken boat that's up here or snorkel it um, so right off to where the full hookup sites are there's a sunken boat that you can snorkel down to so I'm gonna go try to do that Well, there's the tiki bar that we go to on uh, on here at Sigsby. It's called Paradise Cafe, I think. Is that called Paradise Cafe, babe? It's called something. So they got food and drinks and stuff. There's the other part of the uh, Sigsby campground. Most of those are full hookup sites. For the, a couple of these on the along the shore here, a little left of me or uh, dry camping as well. Coming up on the boat here. A little bit closer to shore. There's a shelf that runs out here. Right along that shelf. So it looks like it might be marked with this buoy up here. Looks like we're coming up on it. I'm just using Google Maps. But uh, where that buoy is looks like the perfect location for where this boat might be. So let's go see. All right, beach the uh, kayak so I don't lose it. <laughs> and uh, Jen's gonna meet me out there in her kayak and now uh, we're gonna go check out this boat. What do you think of this crazy hair? Look at this. <sighs> Well, that was pretty awesome, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. That thing still had its engine. <laughs> that makes me wonder if we really want to do boat life or not. Good morning, everybody. We're up bright-eyed and bushy-tailed because we're going to the dry Tortugas National Park today. When we first got here in the beginning of February, we uh, went to book tickets and they said that they were booked until April, so we were pretty bummed. We didn't think we'd be able to get in, but um, Apparently every day they block out one day that's uh, maintenance for the boat in case they need to do it. And um, if they decide they don't need to do it, then they release those dates. So we got lucky. Um, they released this whole day, which is the 22nd of February, and we got in. And as a bonus, our buddy from Alaska, Ray, who was in our one of our videos way back when at the Tampa RV show a couple years ago, um, he came down to visit us and we snagged him a ticket last night. We got lucky somebody had canceled and so he's going with us. So should be an awesome day. So, word of advice, it's $42 to park here all day next to the boat dock. 
Um, you can bring your e-bikes over and park over here, which we were gonna do, but then of course Ray joined us, so we had to uh, um, bring the Jeep. checked in and uh, now we're just waiting to board the ferry our friends who just did this a couple weeks ago gave us some advice to get here early because they give you numbers when you come in and I think the first 30 or so actually can sit like on the top deck uh, so we got 20 21 and 22 so it might be okay Should be some great snorkeling weather. Yeah, it's gonna be nice. Wow, this is unbelievable. Beautiful out here. Totally recommend you coming out here. I haven't even gotten in the water yet. Jason and Ray are already out snorkeling. I decided I wanted to walk around the um, fort just to get some photos and stuff. I started to do the tour, but I just decided to kind of explore on my own. So I'm gonna try to walk. Um, there's a little area down here that I'm gonna try to get to down by the beach, and then I may change and get in the water. I may not, it just all depends on time, but I mean, you can come out to this fort and it is beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful day, beautiful water. I'm gonna have a hard time leaving. I saw dishes. I didn't know they had those back then. <laughs> 